have an air pump and an air stone on, of course, the air hose. The first thing that you need to do is take your air hose and cut off the zip ties that are holding it onto the air stone. Just take a pair of scissors, knife, anything of the sort, unwrap it. The next thing that you want to do is take the air stone and connect it to the tube that attaches to the air pump. Just press it in. It's a light friction fit. Now take your power cord, remove the zip tie, and place the power cord through the rear of your cabinet grommet hole. Now later on in the video what we'll do is plug in all the items into the power strip on the back of your cabinet. <clears throat> when, um, when actually using your air pump you want to ensure that you do not actually stick the air pump in the water it goes on the floor of your unit next to your hydroflora system. The next thing to do is to take your air stone and completely submerge it into your hydroflora system by inserting it through the hole right above the float valve on the far side of the lid. As long as the air stone's in the water, it doesn't matter if it's higher, lower, or anything of the sort, you can just put it in at any point.